Cheryl, what the hell did you do? What the hell indeed, Tony? I thought you didn't want me to meet your Nana because I'm a lesbian. But surprise, it's me and my family she hates with a fiery vengeance. Cheryl, you have to admit that your ancestors were horrible to mine. And now, my Nana is begging me not to go to prom with you. She says that it would dishonor our family. Look, I'm truly, truly sorry I went to see your Nana. But I really hope we're still going to prom together, TT. I hope that when I'm posing for pictures in my amazing dress, that you're there with me, looking equally undeniable. I still want to take a picture of you, dear. But you look like an angel. Thank you, Nana. Perhaps your camera will capture the sublime tragedy of my life. Hey. Don't start crying yet, Cheryl. Tony, you came. Is there ever any doubt? <laughs> Ready? our ceremonial dance, but we did win our crowns. Come fair, TT. Our carriage is waiting to whisk us back to Fizzle House. What's wrong, my sugar plum? I can't go home with you, Cheryl. Because of your Nana. But I don't understand. I thought you picked me. For tonight, I did. My Nana said that if I didn't get home by midnight that she would never speak to me again. I hope you can understand. Of course. Tony, family is the most important thing. Go and be with your Nana. And thank you for tonight. Despite those moments of video horror, I will treasure these memories. Always. Thank you, Cheryl. I'm sure we'll be able to work it out. She just needs time, okay? I don't want to finish.